I needed more soil, so hubby gave me the go-ahead to go to town and get more soil, which I did. But you know me, I cannot walk past plants without buying some. So I got a chamomile, a pansy, a lemon verbena, and I fixed this area all up. It was just junky like that. And I'll get to that soon, not today. The two succulents I got from over there by the house, just to kind of add a little more beauty and some rocks that I needed to do something with. So this looks a lot better. Isn't this daffodil pretty? Just a big yellow face. Well, I didn't get that today. It was growing there and I just couldn't resist showing you. I see of yellow. So what I did get today were these pink and purple. The purple ones are phlox. And the pink one, I didn't recognize the name of what it was, but said it was a perennial. So that was my, my choice to have a perennial. And it looks perfect right next to this uh, that I planted some several weeks ago. lilies are going to be blooming soon. And I think I finally figured out that these are those um, alliums that I put in the ground last fall. They haven't bloomed yet, but they don't look like tulips or daffodils. That's a pretty red tulip. I need to come out and deadhead my daffodils. I have a flower here. And daisies need to I need to pull out last year's foliage there. But they're coming up nicely. And everything looking pretty good out here. So I can tell there's heat in the greenhouse because it steams up, but I have it partly unzipped. One of the things, one of the things that I've been wanting to do is discover the dimensions of this. So I'm going to step it off and count each step. So let me do that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. We'll go twenty-two. Okay, twenty-two lengths. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We'll go with twelve. 
22 by 12 for this for my main garden plot. I will measure out where I had those other flowers at some point. It's not any wider than this, but it's a little bit longer and it, part of it has trees on it, which I can, obviously can't plant something where there's a tree. <laughs> and then I have the area out there, which I have to pull grass out. The grass grew up nicely out there and have a little flower garden in the center there. I'm eating some chicken. <laughs> So that was fun getting to go to town today. Town is like 20 miles away. I shopped at our local feed, feed store, I guess you'd call it. It has clothing on one section, mostly Western style. And then in the back there's guns and ammunition and then there's all the things that ranchers need. When I spend a little time looking at the chicks, <laughs> I have no room for any chicks but they're fun to look at. Although they would get on your nerves after a while, all the constant peeping. <laughs> peep, 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 peep. <laughs> they were cu so cute. They're so cute, the little ones. But they have signs of it. I told the lady that was working back there, I said, this is hilarious. The signs, I had a picture of a little chick on it, and it said, the little chicks are so cute. But remember, they turn into chickens. I think anyone who buys a chick would know that. <laughs> That's the reason they buy them, is because they turn into chickens. <laughs> it was funny, though. Well, I think that makes kind of a short video for today. I did buy uh, another mint plant, a chocolate mint. I had some, I have some sweet mint in some pots. And I put I put all the mints that I don't have currently growing in the ground in the in the little greenhouse. Let's see what else did I put in there? Something else I put in there today. Don't remember what it was, but the shelves are getting kind of full in there. But there's a few things that I can plant out either tomorrow I have tomorrow and the next day or next week. I will eventually get my whole garden planted. I am getting so, 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 so anxious, as I know most of you are too, for your gardens. I get just a teeny bit jealous of those of you who live in warmer zones than I, and can already plant out your tomatoes and peppers and all that stuff. But I'll get there. <laughs> Today is April 27th, my big brother's birthday. Say happy, happy birthday, Peter. <laughs> well, until next time, may the good Lord richly bless you. May your gardens, whatever you're growing, be bountiful, plentiful, and beautiful, and may you always seek the truth. Darlene, signing out. Mm -hmm.